Hi everybody, Happy New Year and welcome back to the Bookhouse for the first time in 2012. My sister and brother-in-law for Christmas got me Stephen King's newest book, 112263. I am really excited to read this. It's about a guy who goes back in time and tries to prevent the assassination of JFK. My book club does a book exchange every year for our Christmas party, and by the luck of the draw, I happened to get The Immortal Life of Henrietta Lacks. And I was really excited about that because I've been wanting to read this book for about a year, but I hadn't ever bothered to check it out of the library or go buy it myself, so I'm really eager it's on my shelf now. And then we decided the books we're going to read for the next few months, so I went and bought myself Room, another book I've been really eager to read because I've been hearing great things about it, and this is the book we decided to read in January. I also got a gift card from the bookstore. That's always useful. And then my friends Nancy, Kate, and Alex went together and got me a Nook! Yeah, it's not even out of the box. I haven't even started to play with it yet. That's because I haven't written my thank you notes yet, and that was always the rule when I was growing up. You couldn't play with your toys till you'd written the thank you notes. But wow, am I excited! And now it's time for some reading resolutions for the new year. Number one. I'm going to stop feeling guilty about all the books I don't get around to reading. I don't read nearly as much or as fast as a whole lot of you do, and there are a lot of you who blog and vlog all of the latest releases, and I love that. So I'm going to keep watching your videos and reading your blogs, and I'll read what I can get to, and the rest I'll just have to save for another day. Number two, I'm going to be better about the books that people loan to me. I have a whole bunch of books lying around my house that people have loaned to me that I really do want to read, but I've had them way too long. So I'm going to hit the reset button. I'm going to return all of those books, and in the new year, any book that somebody loans to me, I'm going to read it within a month, and if I don't get to it, I'm going to return it and apologize. Number three, I'm going to try and read one past award-winning book every month. It might be a Newbery Medal winner from decades ago, or a Prince Honor book from just a few years ago, or a Morris winner. But one a month, I think I can do that. And finally, number four, even though I have a busy few months coming up, I resolve to keep posting book reviews right here on YouTube. I'm going to try and post at least one a month, maybe even more often than that, and I'm even going to do a few giveaways. So keep watching, bookhousers, and keep reading. Happy New Year!